Hello, my name is Stu Wisson and once again welcome to financialspreadbet.com. In this article I'm going to be talking about what is financial spread betting. Well, financial spread betting is a means of taking a speculative trade, a bet, on the financial markets with the aim to making profits from either that derivative going up or down in value. The profits that are made in financial spread betting in the UK, as it's considered gambling, are in fact tax-free, which is one of the reasons why spread betting in the UK, certainly amongst traders, is so very popular. As this is the only financial derivative that can be traded or betted on where their profits are subject to any form of tax. Now, there are some confusions associated with how financial spread betting works, how the trader makes their money, how the broker makes their money, and more recently in the UK press there has been a call to stop this method of gambling altogether. However, given its popularity, this is highly unlikely. Now, I've been teaching financial, sp uh, I've been teaching financial spread betting since 2003. Or, or more to the point, technical analysis and using financial spread betting as a means to aid that understanding of how to trade professionally. Now, I've seen some massive changes in the market over the years, and financial spread betting has become massively popular. In fact, I would say that it's as popular as forex trading in the UK. Now, financial spread betting is available in many other countries, but rather amazingly, it can't be traded in the US. There have been demands for something similar to be provided to traders in the US, but at the moment this is unlikely to materialise any time soon. Having said that, if you are in the US and uh, you are now feeling somewhat glum as uh, to not being able to trade, uh, trade financial spreads, do not despair. Financial spreads are in fact identical to trading any derivative, mostly. Therefore, you can still open demo accounts with the broker's uh, or financial spread betting companies and you can still learn to trade with us and learn about analysis with us too so i don't want you to think that you that you would l that you're left out or that there's sort of no benefit for you to be here now the first thing to understand about financial spread betting is that it's a leveraged trading tool that does not have any actual intrinsic value you do not own in any way whatsoever the item that you are trading on known as the underlying the underlying, the item you are using as a means to gamble on, is there simply for that purpose, nothing more. The advantage of this means that as a trader you can trade on virtually anything within the financial markets, from currencies to stock prices to index markets, commodities, house prices and so much more. The benefits really are very broad in that it allows you to trade the forex markets using the exact same t methods and tools that you would use to trade the forex markets. But any profits you would make trading the forex market using financial spread betting would be tax-free. Whereas if you were trading the forex market directly through an FX broker, any profits that you made from your forex trading would be liable to tax. Now let me explain to you how trading and using financial spread betting is. Then go back on the other articles. And then if you go back on the other articles and you will look from looking at the derivatives, forex and so on, that the methods are in fact identical. The, now with most derivatives, as is the case with financial spread betting, you can, in this case, gamble, um, as it is classed as gambling, and I'll explain why in a moment, that the underlying financial product will either go up or down in value, long or short. The position, rather than being... Uh, taken at the uh, on the open market like it would be through a broker is actually a contrary position taken against the bookmaker the financial spread betting company that you have an account with this is why it's considered gambling because you're simply stating to your spread betting firm that you believe that a stock will go up in value they take the converse position and if you win for each point penny cent that the stock went up and if you went long, you would receive uh, a, a stake times the point rise, which is your profit. So let's say the stock that you traded was stock XYZ, and it was at 100, and you thought it would go higher. You therefore trade £2 per point. Now for each point, penny, cent, the stock goes up, you will gain £2. For each time the stock fell by one point, you would lose £2 per point. Therefore, if you're expecting stock XYZ to go up in value, and you closed the trade say at 120, you would have made 40 pounds. However, the stock had fallen to 80, and you closed the trade, you would have lost 40 pounds. 
unless you had expected the stock to fall, in which case you would have gone short on that stock and would have made £40 from it dropping 20 points. But if it had gone up to 120 as before, you would have lost £40. So as you can see, each trade always has a converse trade. Now, one of the biggest misnomers about financial spread betting companies is that there is a belief that they make their money when you lose money. Now, this is not true. Unlike other bookies, they do not profit when you lose money. Trading, even in the financial spreads, is, zero, is a zero-sum game. Your losses go on to pay someone else that is winning. The spread betting company, if it sees that they are overly exposed in one particular trade, for example, will hedge the trade in the real market to protect themselves. This happens more than you can imagine. Certainly if you are successful and a big hitting trader, chances are that the financial spread betting company will take an automatic hedge against your trade to protect themselves. Usually with the smaller trades they will not do this. They will only hedge against loss. If they see a trend in certain markets or stocks etc and then hedge to protect themselves against having to pay out. So how then do financial spread betting companies make their profits and why should you worry about that? Well the hint is in the name of the derivative, spread. The spread in this case is the difference between the selling and buying price quotes. For example our trade on XYZ would really have been buy at 102 and sell at 98 with the market price being at 100. The difference in the spread is where the broker makes their money. Therefore, with the trader going long and the stock price of XYZ being at 100, but buying at 102, the company, the company makes four pounds, if he's trading at two pound per point, that is. And the trader would not profit till the market had reached 103. Now, one of the other misnomers is the fact that these companies want you to lose money. Well, this is simply not true. If you lose money, you stop trading. If you stop trading, then the spreads company do not make their profit from the trades you open. Believe it or not, and many do not, but logic here simply prevails, is that the companies want you to trade and be successful. The more you trade, the higher per point you trade, the more profit they make, pure and simple. They are here to make you become a successful trader. They, uh, believe it or not, want you to succeed. So do not see the financial spread betting company as your enemy. So as you can see, the financial spreads are a great way of getting access to many markets, trading them with relative ease, and potentially walking away with making some good tax-free profits. Now do not be mistaken that because of the ease of opening an account and trading simplifies making profits. It does not. Far from it. The techniques, methods, tools, analysis and how the markets are driven are almost identical to the rest of the real markets. You should, as a result, treat it with a great deal of respect and understanding. You should learn about analysis, the underlying markets that you're, you're trading on and how they work, everything you possibly can. You should open a demo account, a demo account and learn how, to tra how the systems work and how you work under the pressure of trading and how good your analysis is. So don't forget that we'll be launching our free, completely free, financial trader training course that will also have the option of actual support from me, Stu Wisson. Now if you want to make sure you're on the early bird access and to be notified when it's launched, please don't forget to enter your name and email address in the box on the top right of the sidebar on this webpage.